Sunday afternoon. I stitch a little bit more and uh, I'm dying to start a new project. <laughs> I know, I know it's tomorrow, but I will prepare now some fabric and uh, threads and organizer and I'll come back to the board later. I uh, have to stitch here with red color, also right here. This all we go, will go because um, I have feelings that it was not correct because uh, I can see now that colors are a little bit wrong. And uh, I'll triple, che triple check, but um, I also don't like uh, the quality of stitches. So if you look closer, comparing my crosses to yours, well, it doesn't look as bad on the camera, but you can see here somewhere. Um, Anyway, I stitch a little bit differently. And uh, yeah, I just want to remove some stitches and uh, put the right colors. That's the most important stuff. And guys, look what I have here on my table. Well, this is actually window ledge. <laughs> uh, Gloriana, water lilies, dinky dyes. NPI, all these hand dyed silks. And um, I think this is uh, Delica Beads. Petit Treasure. I'm gonna stitch the medieval flower star number one. Uh, bought a chart, bought a chart, uh, bought this stuff from a lady who was selling her stash. And beautiful crystals, Swarovski. <laughs> so excited, I can't even talk anymore. I'll stitch on 28 count, which I can stitch on 30 seconds. I'll go choose now fabric. I'll show you a picture how it looks like. And uh, just give me a second. I'm gonna start it because I want to stitch with silks. I was just teaching um, Bootsilla kid, their threads are horrible. The, their, uh, at least DMC you can lay proper. These ones are not silky, they're just annoying me. I need to have a break from the threads and I will come back to the design. I love the design, but threads much better when it's uh, DMC. So I wanna show you some of my purchases. I was ordering them last year because it takes time for um, stuff to come here. Also, you know, our difficult time now, all this uh, COVID plus New Year's, Russian Christmas, Russian New Year, <laughs> old New Year. Anyway, um, Jasnen and Mirabilia. This is what I'm buying lately. Uh, crystal roses. I had this chart. I gave her to my friend and uh, I wanted to keep for myself as well because she told me she dreams to stitch something from Jasnan and I was sending her parcel and like, okay, let me make her a surprise. And uh, I chose this one because I like this uh, snowflake a lot. Another design I bought from Jasnan because I, may, uh, I have to make a pre-order when all the girls will uh, make their decision. The shop owner, she is ordering and when stuff comes to come to Ukraine, we paying for them and she ship to our addresses. Anyway, this is some old delights. I like this um, design. I think it looks cute. All aboard and uh, this is from the Bible, Ark Animals. A very easy chart and small key, so it will be stitched very quickly. Maybe this year, because I'm looking for something to stitch this year, something small. I, I chose already, but um, you know, when I'll get tired from my big designs, I'll take something small, whatever I will see. This one I like a lot. I thought. This Christmas Eve from Just Nan was out of print. I don't know why. Maybe because of the deer. 
you can see him here he is also in just nan mary 15 and uh, i can't see the key but i mm, i think it will be stitched on 28 count sparkling uh, something sparkling i would like to uh, use for this design but anyway there will be areas where i can use cranic if i'll choose just uh, natural linen and um, i'll add extra beads to uh, christmas trees if i will think it will be better i don't want to over done this design is beautiful by itself and the beads looks like okay quality because just nine likes to put some bits which is not the best anyway uh, this is mouse winter roll limited edition uh, mouse cedar roll i have them all now that was the last one huge key <laughs> and embellishment pack uh, I don't know when I'll stitch it, maybe next year, maybe this year. Again, I don't make lots of plans because uh, I've, I've done them before and uh, I would like to follow them. So, yeah, I, I like that uh, here again you use natural linen. You don't have to worry about uh, which fabric to choose because we have big problems here with the fabric. Uh, like anywhere else now. And some Mirabilia chart. I was not showing you before, but this one, this order, I decided to show you. Mm, this is perfume, mermaid. Or how you call it? Yeah, mermaid perfume by Nora Corbett. Huge key. Look at the Karen Water Lilies list. And of course, tre treasures. I order treasures as well because of the situation with the Swarovski. And. Uh, I don't know, I just decided to buy all the bead pack. I didn't buy any of uh, water lilies because I have some in my stash and it's, it's very easy to order anytime. Uh, for me, I need to have uh, treasures, it's the most important. And the little Nora Corbett designs, uh, one is holy, another one is magnolia. They are uh, so pretty, I like them a lot. I think I'm gonna stitch them on a white linen because I would like to have a wall of pixies and uh, I want them to look uh, same. Various pixies, Little Mermaid as well, they are all uh, will look great all together. So you can see how much uh, Mill Hill bits you will use in this design and uh, I'll use my leftovers. I'm not gonna buy just for this design some so it's only uh, only bits only if they will not look okay i'll order but i'm trying to use my leftovers number first of all and the reason i don't have lots of um, nora corbett designs in my stash is because um, again i not buying uh, stuff for them only if i will have something uh, from big mirabilias i'll use in them but sometimes I want to stitch something <laughs> small and uh, because I have big designs, something in between, right? I uh, need this kind of designs because when I stitch dimensions gold, petites, they're difficult. These designs are much easier and um, well, I'll spend less time and I'll feel better because I would not uh, spend so much effort, I would not put so much effort to this kind of designs as to um, gold petites. I'm looking at this picture now, <laughs> it's pretty as well, like it so much, but they're not the easiest. And guys, look how much beads I have, it's all for Mirabilias, some of uh, the treasures for Nora Corbett um, deers and um, yeah this one is Snow Queen because of the treasures I need this bit pack anyway because I'm gonna stitch her and some treasures for 164 Mirabilia I can't remember which one but 
all the treasures are here whatever chart requires i just bought treasures for some mirabilis because i just don't want to buy uh, double uh, bits bits i have already i will have some leftovers but treasures i definitely uh, will need them all because you never have leftover treasures uh, 162 look how pretty this one is mm, i still have to buy a thing for uh, fairies shakespeare's fairies uh, this one 16 I can't even remember now. I used to know every single design numbers and everything. Now I forgot because I don't look at them anymore. I collect the charts. I uh, have them and I don't worry about them anymore. New slide from just then. Another one. I think it was a gift because I did not order it. Embellishment for mermaid perfume. Also, there are treasures there. That's why I've got all package. This one I was my favorite in 2016. One of my favorite. I had the list of the most beautiful mirabilias I wanted to stitch, but um, because I was focusing on mirabilias which are out of print, firstly I was buying them, and this one I did not even buy chart. I, mean, I think I bought this one. But now I'm buying slowly, slowly them. Also, there are um, treasures. So I bought these bitbags only because of the treasures. And this is bit bag for one of the most beautiful Mirabilia dressmaker daughter. I'm gonna stitch her on, on original fabric. Well, if it will be still for sale, I hope it will. Even I don't like Witchel fabrics, but this is the color I like a lot. I met a stitchy friend, she's also a blogger, and um, I just can't stop staring at this amazing, amazing sampler from Anne Thomas, I mean from the Hands, hands Across the Sea samplers, Anne Thomas. You know this sampler very well, she's stitching on a 40s count with silks, and the fabric is from Ukrainian dyer. It's beautiful. And today I'm starting stitching Asian woman from Lanarte. This is how she look like. I saw her stitch on uh, Facebook by one man. And this is the size in centimeters. Yeah, she's quite large. As lots of my projects. And you can see here her nose. I think I'm gonna stitch right here because I see where I stopped because I don't know where it, the chart is uh, big but there are four pieces so I can see right there I stopped somewhere and I'll stitch it now I don't have organizer I have original organizers for her and you can see how much threads she has lots of them I call it Swiss stop. I call it uh, horse tail. <laughs> Once I was teaching uh, blackbird design, and I bought instead of um, five um, yards, ten yards in in one uh, skein. Yeah, it was also lots of threads. It reminds me of horse tail. <laughs> so I was above to stitch and. I did not understand where is the lower part 
because I told you I want to stitch somewhere here and uh, I was like for me it will be more comfortable to stitch right here but I could not find this in the chart uh, like no I have to get up and see where is another part because I, I know I kept everything but look this is a part supposed to go here and here are my marks when you don't stitch for a long time, you forget everything. This is I hate about having lots of projects. It's fun to change them, but then you don't remember even how your chart looks like. Yep, going back to stitching. Today is 25th of February. Few more days and we'll have spring here. And um, we cel not celebrate. Uh, our spring starts here exactly on uh, 1st of March. But my mom told me this spring will be delayed and it will be colder. Winter was crazy, <laughs> I have to say, unusual. So I'm stitching this Asian lady from Lanarte. And uh, this is my progress. I think I stitch a lot. I mean, it seems like to me, but I don't know. A very easy project. The thing is here, you take one thread and you finish it. You don't have to use extra organizer. This is what I like about uh, this uh, project. As well, um, they're a little bit shorter than I get used to, especially when you stitch lots of dimensions. I have to say, I need some rest from dimensions gold. I need some break because um, I feel like I'm working now, not uh, teaching something for myself, like I, I have to do it and I don't like it. Uh, I want to enjoy it and I want to do it just for myself, not because I have to. Yes, I'm now stitching lots of projects, but uh, I can do it in the beginning of the year. I can play with them, I can change them. At the end of the year, I will be focusing more on finishes, which is also not easy. Because you, uh, I'll have, I have to, I have to, I have to in my head, in my mind. But uh, I hope slowly, slowly I will uh, push some designs during the year uh, to till the end. So I'll finish them in the middle of the year as well. But the, I have to say they're all big. As you can see, this one is like, I know chance I'll finish you this year, but who knows? Because uh, honestly speaking, I don't want to put her down. I don't. Wa I want put her away. I, I want stitch uh, to stitch her, and I want to enjoy this project because um, it's interesting. And uh, I can't uh, believe how fast time fly by when I uh, work with this design. And even my yellow color, I don't like. I still enjoy it very much. There will be flowers soon. Actually, right here, the flower. And I want to uh, stitch this part because I don't want to move hoops. We'll see how it will go. Uh, great news. If you're a fan of Lanarte, there will be a reprint. I just will show you this in a second. Which designs. And I was happy to see that design I really wanted for a long time to the gates and everything like that. But this is modern village, it's not village village. Great. I love it. We'll say good 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 shot. Thirteenth of March and it's snowing. Susie's freezing because I hired her winter jacket. Oh, let's go, Susie! Susie, stop eating some crap. Let's go, Susie, my little wolf.
Today is 22nd of February. I'm working on uh, Dana's Roses, Putsila, and I uh, stitch a lot. I, I can see the result because I took a picture on Sunday, yeah, yesterday, and now I see I made big progress. Even I was not stitching it on Sunday a lot. Made like 200 crosses at least, but I took a picture. But today I stitch a lot. I forgot my phone in the morning and I could not uh, distract myself from anything, so I was stitching. Now I know why I don't stitch a lot lately. <laughs> Too much time I spent on the phone, but anyway, this is a uh, design which reminds me of watercolors and um, there are a few more I would like to stitch as well, including some dimensions designs. I think uh, Iris is there also watercolor design and um, yeah, from Riolis there are a few will be stitched and they're all uh, quite large. Uh, I have nothing else to say. It's just very interesting to stitch uh, this uh, background. Uh, even I don't really uh, like to stitch big areas of um, uh, with one color, but he, because here you see. Uh, there are some quarter stitches and uh, I just like colors, I guess. Today is 14th of March, I can't believe. <laughs> Time is flying so fast and I decided to uh, start uh, stitching something uh, what I've left. And my plan is uh, to have more than half of this dimensions called done. Uh, even I just finished stitching uh, the little mandala, chatelaine. My mind still with that work because uh, you know after you stitching with silks and uh, specialty stitches as well, you little bit tired from specialty stitches, but silks you adore to stitch with, and um, I uh, I know that I need to. Uh, mix all kinds of uh, designs, so I will not uh, get tired, I will not get used, and I will have bigger, uh, more progress. So I just stitched a little bit of this uh, roof of the house, and I even made a little mistake, <laughs> and don't mind these uh, um, threads, they're from before, I did not uh, uh, clean work, because I need to have crosses, Susie, wait a second. Uh, I need to stitch crosses and then half stitches, otherwise I'll make lots of mistakes. I need to have crosses first, because... Uh, yes, you will go now. She wants to come to mine. Okay, guys. <laughs> Susie! Susie! Susie. Okay, my try number, I don't know, <laughs> maybe 10, because keep uh, recording video and someone is calling me. Everyone needs me always when I'm recording video. <laughs> yeah, I'm getting used to it. So, I have a finish. This is just Nan Fairy Roses. And uh, today is 15th of March morning. I have uh, two hours to upload videos, to edit them and to record for you. So uh, I just wanted to stitch something small because I have uh, bigger projects and I wanted uh, something um, with uh, spring or flowers, uh, you know, because we're all tired from winter. Well, who lives in, <laughs> not in Australia or uh, other part of the world where it is um, autumn now. So I uh, chose this design because I love this charm and my friend gave to me this design and she told me it's very pretty. If you want, I can gift it to you. I'm like, yeah, sure. And believe me, I was excited to start stitching this design and uh, 
the thing is here lots of confetti if you look closer uh, even algerian eyelids and um, I was really tired before I was going to bed. I stitch it uh, like 30 minutes every day. And then I said to myself, no, it's not going to work because I have no, I, I don't enjoy this design anymore. It's too complicated. And I don't understand why, but now I do because I'm stitching now another design from just Nan called Laurentian Floral. I have it uh, in uh, my other apartment. Uh, where, oh, the chart is here. One second. But just for you to understand, the chestnut is so different, and like this design, it's much easier. You see, it's you can see it on the chart. Uh, chart that uh, it's uh, less confetti and it's much easier to stitch, and you really enjoy it when you're tired, when you want something easy, and uh, so I tell I told myself I have to take it. Um, to my main rotation and just finish it because it was like half a day of work but if i will continue stitching 30 minutes a day i will probably will never uh, finish it by the end of the uh, spring <laughs> and um, yeah i finished it and i was so happy and you know when you stitch this kind of designs when you fresh you when you have power it's different story but um, when you're tired it's better to take something easy when you don't have to stitch uh, but then you have to think it a lot and um, yeah then i went to kiev and before that i wanted to find a charm because i remember my friend added to susie to um, one of my uh, parcels uh, from her i could not find it couldn't find it. I came back from Kiev. It took me uh, three days to find this charm. I was trying to remember where and how. Oh, it was not the uh, best moment for me because I could have stitched all this time, but I could not because I was thinking, where is the charm? Where is the charm? I almost finished this design. I don't have a charm. And then I uh, uh, turn on my logic. <laughs> I know I show you in one of my videos and uh, usually when I finish recording I have lots of things to clean and I was trying to remember with what I was showing you this charm which parcel I get from my friend so it's probably there and uh, after three days going through same stuff over and over again I found it with um, Wix Day Works threads Anyway, it was a happy moment. I was dancing. I was uh, happy. I was like, yeah. <laughs> I thought maybe it'll take another half a year. During the time I was looking for this charm, I found some stuff I've lost uh, from another just name design. And I was lucky that my friend uh, had a spare um, embellishment and she finished my uh, little pin cushions. Anyway, yes, I have a finish. <laughs> my third finish this year the three finishes are super small third to second can't remember but yes i'm stitching now this design i'll show you in my next video i have stitch almost half of it and now what i'm busy with i keep forgetting to bring uh crystals so I, sometimes uh, we, we are working now in two different places with my husband, so we don't bother each other during the day. And uh, half of my stuff with Paul, half of my stuff here. And I was keep, uh, kept forgetting to bring crystals. So I will not talk about this design a lot, but um, I just uh, want to show you that uh, I was busy with something, you know, uh, I did not finish to um, uh, making holes in this uh, Algerian outlets and uh, it, it should be all um, done nicely and then I will show you uh, completed work. But I made mistake in the sleeves, it should be another uh, back stitch darker and uh, it bothered me and I uh, will not leave it as it is. So, just a uh, <laughs> quick update. 
Yeah, but I'm extremely happy. It, it's um, something I needed uh, to break my routine, to break my um, other designs, which I'm tired of. And uh, believe me, I spent lots of time with this little tiny, um, what is the name of this uh, Chatelaine design? But it will be four of them, uh, four different flowers, uh, not flowers, it's... Um, well, I call them flowers. It is flower, actually. Yes, it is flower. Um, we uh, as well in Russian uh, saying that they're uh, pharmacy flowers, something like that. But I'm not sure, not sure. And uh, yeah, I I'm going to work on it till I finish, and then I will show you the whole result and I will explain you my feelings. But something I really needed.